Yo, Zach! Guess what up, what up? Back, 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 back again. Ken, Ken, champ is back, 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 back again. Ken, Ken. We're having technical difficulties on this side of the board. Hey, I'm just saying, welcome back to the degenerate, you motherfuckers. This is degenerously. We're hard nosed. We are no fucks given and respect the champ's name at all times. You go from last place to first place once. Once, and we're all forced to deal with this for a lifetime. Hey, how does it happen? How does the saying you, go? You, go you won your, your own league first. once. You won your own league once, and we all have to hear it for the rest of time. I Hey, until someone beats me next year, or the year after, or the year after, because I might win two or three or four or five in a row. You LeBron, chill. Chill. Okay, you're not winning... Two. I might, I might pull three. a Robert Ori and have not winning four. You're I not winning five. You ain't winning six. <laughs> I might, I might be like fucking uh uh old man uh from Boston Celtics and uh, Boston, Boston <laughs> fucking I can't remember his name off the top of my head because I fuck Boston. Exactly, he disappeared into history. <laughs> Into history. I just hate I hate Boston history, so I try to forget it. <laughs> All right, man. Tell <laughs> Welcome about back, guys. Welcome back. It's the Degenerates League. First episode uh of the new year for you guys. It's me and Zach here. You already know the Degenerates have been around a little short s- story for you guys. Generates have been around for about four years now. Well, going on the fourth season. Uh we had three different champs. We had Mike, Mike Burke. Uh, we had Marcus, Mark Ass, and we had uh, me, reigning champ. So season four is a whole new, a whole new uh, saga, a whole new battle, a whole new journey. Um, we got some new members. We have uh, Sarah from Breaking Down the Tape, who is uh, assistant to the commissioners. Come uh, assistant to the commissioner. So, She's the assistant to the assistant to the commissioner. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so <laughs> that's that's uh, Zach's wife, um, second lady in the league. We also have Brian. Uh, excuse me if I get it wrong. O'Mara, I'm pretty sure. A uh, good friend of Marcus and ours, and uh, um, Mike, who is uh, what back to back runner up champ. <laughs> I think so. Mike Khaleesi. Shout out to Mike Khaleesi, man. Back to back. We all, no (laughs) offense to Mike, but we all have to veto one of his trades this year. We just have to. Well, the thing is, is like, yeah, just to fucking piss him off, we have to. We have to. But the the, the fact that he even got into the fucking, uh, uh, the final match. After that, like, it's ridiculous. And- so, uh, honestly, props to Mike, though, because Mike got a trade vetoed, was mad at everybody, changed his name to Blacklisted, kept trying to motherfucking pawn off Tyler Lockett because he had one 50-point game and was running his mouth about, oh, my God, Tyler, I can't believe you guys don't like Tyler Lockett. Woe is me. Woe is me. And still came in fucking second place. So you got to give kudos to that, man. I know we cut it out of him a lot last year, but you got to give kudos Bro, to that. that man, that man, I give it to him. He knows his football. He, he did. Knows football. He played a hell of a Some year, reason. man. Some reason. He but he lost back-to-back years to – the best friends, Marcus and me. So it sucks to lose to 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 not the not the not the wife, but also the husband. My, so which one of you is the wife? Which one of you is the husband? Why do you think I say the wife first? Marcus was the first one to win. So if you guys haven't listened to the Gen- Degenerates episode last year, it's on Spotify in its own playlist. Go back, listen to the playlist. You'll find that there is a lot of shit talking. And it's only going to get better this year. Because last year, it was just Hector and I getting drunk. 
But this year, Hector, tell them what's going on. Oh, this year we got some new and improved ideas. What we want to do, like I said, we already got some new members in the league. We got some uh, uh, new rules. Uh, most of the rules are almost all the same, except the fact that money might be going up. Also, uh, what we're trying to do is throughout the season, as it goes on, um, we want to try to bring on uh, every single person on the Degenerates individually. We want to bring them on. We want to engage with them. We want you guys to know a little bit about them, know who they are, know their real names, know how they do their business in Fantasy League, um, and just shoot the shit about that week's progress with that person. And we can just, you know, go over every week uh, uh, how the how the games went and mm -hmm. give them their chance to just shit on people like we do. Yup, and do some round tables, you know, get some guys on. Maybe if there's a great fucking matchup, get both of those players on to fucking live the matchup again and talk that shit again. We're gonna we're on YouTube now this year, so trust me, I'll be posting fucking screenshots of the fucking points and the way they played out and shit like that throughout the videos. Uh, we've got a lot more in store this year. So if you if you liked the shenanigans that was last year. You're going to fucking love this year. <laughs> and it's even better because, like I said, like Sarah is, is Zach's wife. Christy is now my fiance. Well, they're in the houses with us. So while we got these people on, we can always just have them jump into the screen, jump on and say some crazy shit. They're mm -hmm. both Dallas Cowboys fans. So they'll jump on and probably Google eye each other. And try to like circle <laughs> jerky or scissor each other through the fucking screen. So <laughs> uh, we want to do a live draft as well, a live, you know, a live fantasy draft night as well. You know, whether it's all of us, if we can get everybody on fucking StreamYard at the same time. If not, you know, a couple people throw a fucking party, whatever it is. I personally want to do a hotel party, but that's just fucking me. Uh, <laughs> um, but uh, but yeah, yeah I'm, okay I'm excited well, for this year. What'd you say? I said anything on with alcohol is okay on my end. Yo, big facts. Um, I've already got what I'm planning to spend my winnings on. Um, I've already bought a couple of things in. You mean your third place winnings? No, no, my first place. First, number one. No, thir third place winnings, which we don't know. Okay, so a little bit more to the the fans out there. If the league, because I am a fair and generous commissioner. Okay. I always keep in contact with my league. I send out polls. I send out invites to people to just say what they want to say. And and uh, we're trying to de determine what the new price is. So last year it was $50 a head. Um, that went well, obviously, because I won. Um naturally <laughs> and uh this year we might raise it there's a poll out there it could be 50 dollars again it could be 75 dollars. it could be 100 dollars. it could be 300 dollars. who knows all right um, all right for some of us who have two players in the same household can we not get above 100 dollars, please and thank you i got two players in the same household too yeah you're good for you i'm poor that i will rig this whole shit <laughs> <laughs> Collusion no. caught on camera. And, Take that, Rob but, Manfred. <laughs> Roger but Goodell, we, we, we are we are uh, uh, doing a poll right now, up to a hundred dollars to see, figure out what the prices will be for the league. And once we figure out that price, um, the winnings might actually change. And there's right. also a bazinga for this year. I like so. I say we do a hundred bucks. Say we do 50 bucks. It doesn't matter. I'm going to take a slot of that winnings. I'm going to put it and invest it into a trophy for the league. Uh, previous winners will be uh, stashed on to the trophy. Yeah. Um, starting back from season one. So it's not like it's starting from last season with me. It was it's not like starting with this season with whoever wins. Sure. Um, we're starting back with season one. I'll stitch everyone. Mike. 
Marcus and me's names. Um, whoever wins this league, their name will get stitched on um, mm-hmm. and mailed out to them. They will hold it for the year. And my only thing is that I hope and res- and and pray that everyone respects the league uh, every year. They will mail it to the next winner. Um, uh, uh, they can uh, get the the name stitched on in a shit. I will even put my own money into getting the name stitched on and de- taking care of all right. that. Just get the trophy where it needs to get, and don't be that guy. Right. Um, but it'll be super fun. Yeah. No, I'm I'm fucking excited. I'm I'm excited. Oh, and as another thing, so the winner is gonna get be getting a trophy, but the loser, like always has to do a league agreed upon punishment. Obviously, we're not I'm not getting shit tattooed on me. I hate to break it to all of you. I'm not getting ridiculous shit done. Like uh, you're not gonna get my face. Alright, so if on your ass cheek, just on your ass cheek, pointing to your butthole, like all right. If I come in last place, I might not be opposed to that. Right? Like not it doesn't have to be big. It doesn't have to take your whole ass cheek because you got a big ass cheek. Not me, yet. Have you seen me? I'm white. I got white people butt. You know? <laughs> just a little, just a little, just. <laughs> but yes, yeah, so punishments is also league agreed upon. <laughs> Hector had to do a, um, had to do a 24 hour stint in a, uh, in a Waffle House, right? I, uh, I hop. I did an I hop. Yeah, I hop. Right. A lot of pancakes. Right. I didn't spend the whole pancake. 24 hours. I didn't get through all the pancakes, but I did as much as I could, honestly. That shit was rough. Right. And for every pancake, you would take an hour off. If I could get that punishment, bellissimo. Uh, no, see, Mark, see that, that's the thing. Marcus did it because he knows I can't eat pancakes like that. Yeah, see, I... You, I'm, you good all like would like pink, I'm, I'm good for a three-stack, and then after that, I'm like, nah, I'm good. <laughs> I mean, no, I suck at eating pancakes. That would be a terrible punishment as well. Please don't do that to me if I lose. That would be horrible. Thing, the only thing that sucks is, like, they kick you out after a while. <laughs> do they really? You got you to gotta come in there with, like, a sign that says this is for a punishment. I'll tip I know, I should have. Me and Chrissy <laughs> wasn't there. We were sitting there for, like, two hours, and they were like, um, are you going to leave soon? <laughs> like, no. We're only two hours in. <laughs> right. How many pancakes Ooh. do you think I can eat? Two hours in and, and six pancakes. What the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> oh, shit. But, guys, anyway, go back, listen to the degenerates, uh, catch yourself up on the shenanigans that inc- uh, occur. Um, I can't wait for because I've got some new technologies, I've got some new things that will aid in my visual representations. Um, We've got some new fun things coming for you guys as far as, like, uh, interviews and and lives and stuff like that with some of the cast and crew. And a couple other fucking uh, things in line, too. Um, I kind of want to change things up just a small bit when it comes to the fantasy, Um, like, us, us 12 in there. Right. Nothing too crazy. Nothing that I'm gonna give away to anyone right now, but definitely things that like I'm gonna talk to you on the side about and 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 reach out to the league, um, because I want to keep it interesting. I want to keep okay. it fun, and um, if not everything in the league is a competition, can, can, then it'll be more fun. I'm with it. Or not I'm everything has to do with like money and a competition. You know what I mean? Sure. Like there's things that we can do within the league. Right. Right. That so doesn't have to do with what the league is ultimately about. Right. Right. Super teasers there. I do really want to do a draft day and have a competition for who has the best draft outfit. I've already got mine planned out in my head. Oh, you like, already. I'm, oh man, you can't you can't beat the fat boy drip. I promise you that. The fat first fat boy drip. Shout out to fucking uh, uh <laughs> well, uh, who John uh, Seaton? John John C- Seaton. <laughs> I was trying to remember. I was like it's something with an S. See, I didn't. Want, I was gonna say S- Saul. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, way to fuck that up. Yeah, John, John Seaton. Yeah, from Elon man. We did an interview with oh, him. Go check out the episode. Drip, man. 
Exactly. Exactly. Uh, but anyway, yeah. So I don't want to keep this episode too long. Uh, next week we'll divulge a little bit more about the degenerates and go into some of the league and see if maybe we can get, uh, get another member on here. Yeah. So, um, just to shout out real quick, uh, the draft so far as of now will be August 28th, 6 30 PM. Um, no one has contested so far. So it seems like that Saturday will be a go. <laughs> On top of that, the league should be a $100 league by the poll that looks right now. looks like it's a unanimous almost for a $100 league. And um, once that goes, man, oof. I can't fucking wait, man. I can't wait for football season to be back. We're like three weeks away. I'm going to make excited. sure that I plug myself in as the number one overall pick. Again. Okay, hey, which okay. wound up so, being so, why you won. No, cut it out. Cut it out right now. Cut it out. <laughs> Mind you, I don't like the number one overall pick. It's fun for the number one overall pick. I don't like it. I want a, I want a middle of the pack pick like I got right now on a, a, a Who's Tribunal with seven out of 14. I'm okay with taking I, number one. I, hey, I made it work with number one and I won. But it's not the easiest thing to do. It is when you're a fantasy god like myself. Okay, so when Ghost jumps on and calls you out for the bullshit you have spoken. (laughs) Because you come second to the man he hates the most. (laughs) Wait, he's going to come first? I mean, he'll come first. But... (laughs) You'll come second to the man he hates the most. Yeah, I know. That was the joke. You missed it. No. <laughs> Let's no. wrap this up. Hit him with it. I said what I said. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even. The generous is going to be a good fucking league. Y'all motherfuckers ain't ready for this shit. I said what I said. <laughs>